And moving on, if you haven't heard yet and haven't heard this buzz, a record-breaking Powerball drawing has millions of Americans on the edge of their seat tonight. The Powerball frenzy may reach an end this very evening. If there is a winner, that's yet to be determined. But WUFT's Katerina Sardi tells us how ticket sales here in Gainesville have reached an all-time high. For just $2, you could be a multimillionaire. If you're a winner, of course. Gainesville residents are stocking up on their last chance at winning the Powerball tonight, with a jackpot currently worth about $500 million. If I go by the bank, if I get at least some money out of my six on I think that would do my eyes good. Tickets have been selling at a rate of over 8,000 tickets per minute, with no sign of slowing down. We sold like $9 million worth of tickets yesterday in one day, which is a pretty good chunk of tickets. And today it should really double, probably. No one has won the Powerball since October 6th, which has resulted in large rollovers. By the end of the day, when ticket sales have closed, that number could reach up to $550 million. You got your magic Powerball number yet? Yes, ma'am. The winner, or winners of the Powerball, have two options. The cash option allows them to receive the money all at once, about $330 million. The second option allows them to receive the full amount of the jackpot over a 30-year period. It's an exciting time for people that have a dream. You know, they spend two bucks, they get to think about what they're going to do between 9 and 11 o'clock tonight anyway. And after the drawing, they're either going to, dreams will come true or they won't. <laughs> dreams that come with a strategy. Pick your own number and play it as many times as you can. So hopefully with that advice, the odds will be a little bit better. His odds being 1 in 175 million. Katerina Sardi, WUFT News. The Powerball drawing is at 11 o'clock tonight. If no winner is announced, the jackpot will roll over once again to be the largest Powerball in history.